sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. It's so embarrassing. I used to take myself out on dates. Open my own damn doors, pay for everything on my plate. Sometimes I even get the steak. Good morning guys, happy Monday, welcome back to another weekly vlog. Almost, it's quarter to 12 right now. I'm about to head off to an appointment to go get my masseters retreated because it's been about six months since I last got it done and I have a feeling that's probably why I've been sleeping really really badly lately like i'm talking like i just cannot sleep for the life of me i don't know what's happening so i didn't go to the gym this morning because i couldn't get to sleep till like 2 a.m and i was like it's probably not a good idea to try and get up at 5 a.m it probably do more damage than like benefit me so i just decided to give it a miss this morning i would go this afternoon but like i have this appointment and i'm also probably gonna get i think it's like skin needling or like the, it's called derma pen which is gonna make my skin look really like red so probably not gonna go to the gym just it helps with like acne scarring redness like literally everything because it's like it's like a healing thing with your skin i'm sure nurse dior will be able to explain it better so that's what i'm doing masseters and my uh the skin needling like hopefully tomorrow my skin's not like too inflamed but, like hopefully i can put a bit of makeup on just because i don't want to be like self-conscious but yeah i've just been doing some editing i made the weekly vlog thumbnail i can check that off my to-do list and now i'm gonna go to this appointment and then i might also stop into chemist warehouse to see if they have like any type of something to help me sleep i don't know let me google it it's very annoying i've never been one to like have bad sleep this lighting is great like i've never been a bad sleeper but yeah, like the past week or so, I've just, like midnight and over, I've been going to sleep, which is not like me. I've, I've always been like a between like 11.30, not 11.30, like between 10.30, 11 type of gal. And sleep is so important. So important. Like, anyway, it's also really nice and cool today. Like it was very cold this morning. Um, so hopefully it sticks around. I love the cold weather so much i know it doesn't even get that cold in brisbane but it's 23 degrees right now which is quite warm i can't take myself seriously um but like i think it was 12 degrees this morning i'm also going to stop at my parents house and see if there's any packages there for me i can't understand the sliding so let's do this fam okay so i just went to the supermarket no the post office and i got a package I don't know what this is. I'm gonna quickly open it. Oh, it's from John Frieda. Whoop. They've sent their Frizz Ease Weightless Wonder shampoo and conditioner. It's like a little Frizz serum. That packaging's really cool. You can see that there. Interesting. Thank you so much, John Frieda. Some like um, PR agencies obviously haven't got my new address yet. All right, let's skedaddle. in this section and also yeah. give you less headaches you don't mm -hmm. wake up in the night feeling a bit mm. tight yeah. i think this is probably the best treatment that we've mm -hmm. possibly done it's literally life because it's kind of like intrinsic factors like you know stress and exercise yeah. it does amplify yeah and because you're working out so exactly. much more when you're lifting weights mm -hmm. probably a subconscious thing you're clenching oh, down I, yeah for sure and i'm doing a lot more like weightlifting now. and what you did back when yeah. we first started this mm -hmm. treatment I love all these earrings. Did you get them done? Yeah, I ah! yeah, I'm like I love so many earrings. Oh, which one was the new one? Um, this one, the Travis. Oh, did yeah. that hurt? It did hurt. Which mm -hmm. is worse, injectables or that? Um, the Travis hurts a lot, but it's over really quickly. Does the pain linger around? That was probably the most painful piercing I've had. It was really like it's quite it's all right now, but it was quite achy for a long time. Punch. You couldn't lay on your sides, hey. Mm. <laughs> Dad, lay down. Stay tuned. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just turning this way. So you remember it's a bit of a yeah, weird a sensation. Weird feeling. It's kind of like acupuncture. <laughs> okay, just got done at Beautiful. We didn't end up doing the derma pen today just because it might like irritate my skin, like because obviously we've injected. So I might do it later on this week. It's just because there is like a recovery period, obviously, of like 
a couple days where I can't really, like I look a bit crazy for a few days. Yeah, I'm excited to get some tension relieved on my jaw and stuff because it's just been really bad lately. But it's 2 p.m. It's such a weird feeling. If you've ever had it done, it feels like, like it, why is that on there? It's too early. Yeah, I love the girls at um, Beautiful. I see Nurse Dior. Dior is the only person who has ever touched my face with injectable. I trust her with my life because I don't want to look crazy or anything like that. And honestly, the masseter treatment has been life changing because I don't get headaches and it's incredible. I'm going to head home. I might pop into Chemist Warehouse and see if I can Google something that's like to help me go to sleep at night. I haven't been having my Naked Harvest Moon Milk because I run out and that usually helps me really get to sleep. I already know better. 24K got nothing on me. Make you want it for Good morning guys. Happy Tuesday. It's 5.30 right now. Getting ready to go to the gym. Look at this new Gymshark puffer jacket. So warm. Um, I'm trying to figure out what I want to wear to the gym because this is a new gym. I'm like slowly introducing like bright colors. I'm like getting there, even though, even though I'm in like all black at the moment. That sucks. It's cold today though. She's chilly this morning. I love the cold weather. The only thing I don't like about it is the fact that it is harder to get up early. But I don't know which one I prefer. I think I like both working out in the evening and working out in the um morning. Alrighty, made it to the gym. <sighs> um, I will, oh, I look <laughs> I'm excited to be able to incorporate footage from the gym, but like that might be a little bit. My hair's a tricky one because we do a lot of like barbell stuff. Can't really wear a hat because I would just keep whacking it. Like, um, I kind of have to bobby pin it or just deal with it in my face. Chat to you after. Alrighty, currently in the giraffe's drive through my arms are so sore. We did like squat snatches today, which I've never done those before in my life. <laughs> I think I put weight on like five kilos and then I quickly took that off because I don't know what I'm doing and I don't want to hurt myself. When it's like really cross, like cr all the CrossFit movements, I you got to be really careful not to hurt yourself because it's very easy to hurt yourself. But I think I did okay. I'm loving it. Like honestly, it's it's really exciting to like have something different Um, because obviously I did F45 for so long, which I love it. I think it's the best place to start honestly but I'm so excited to see where we're gonna go from here but yeah my arms are killing me but I'm in the giraffe's drive-thru right now thought I'd get a coffee treat myself gonna go home wash my hair I think I'm gonna have a big like or try and have a good content day today get some Instagram work done I'm also gonna meet up with George Rach and Ellie on Friday um they were some of the girls from the well Ellie I met on the naked harvest retreat and Rachel and George I've known for years like literally I think I met them in 2018 that's crazy. So I'm so excited to see them. All right. Could I please get a tall almond milk flat white? That's everything. Like not in a, I've injured my back kind of way, just in a, like obviously using my back for work. I wanted to try and get my mop and try and do this snatch thingies. I feel so like, like so new to everything cause they, all the terminology, like squat snatch, split jerk. So there's so much to know. If I pretend this is the barbell. Which Eventually, it's just like I'm not gonna whip out my phone slash camera on the first week being like hi Let me film everything. No, my hands are very sore. 
They're gonna get absolutely destroyed. They weren't cute before, they're gonna be even worse now. Right, let me, I probably should write a to-do list, hey? Good morning guys, happy um, Wednesday, I'm not sure what day it is, 9.57 right now, I'm about to hop on a Zoom call with my manager, that is a bruise from the gym, oh it's actually quite sore, I'm so, I've got the window open and I don't want my neighbours to hear me talking to myself, but I am so sore, I went to the gym this morning, we did like, <clears throat> more barbell and stuff like that. Um, and I'm very, very sore. I'm loving it. I'm gonna be completely honest, I'm feeling very off myself today. Like I don't feel great. I feel just very down and just down in the dumps, not for any particular reason. But that's just the reality of what today is. Um, I'm probably not gonna push myself too much to like be super productive. I'm just gonna like let myself feel these feelings, feel a bit down and I'm gonna pop on like a fresh tan tonight, a bit of a pamper sesh, feel really good, so I'm like nice and bronzy. I really wanna go get my nails done. I haven't had my nails done in the very long, like I don't get my nails done. Like I, you guys know, I do them myself. Well, there's no way though I could have my super long nails and go to the gym because I would break my finger. <laughs> but I'm tempted to go maybe get some like nice nails or something because my actual nails are quite good. The skin around them, not so much. I can't believe my bruise. I don't bruise that easily, so. What you doing? Where you at? Oh, I'm so sore. I've got bruises like all over me. <laughs> Hello. So I didn't really get up to much in that regard, yeah. so pretty chill, yeah. Tomorrow, I know. It feels good to be back now after I had that. Tell me you know I'm with the book. I'm moving along from somebody wrong. Now. So go ahead. Tell me all the ways you miss it. How you want me back in your bed. I know they did that to me. Did I think it's too so busy? I know. Oh, so I'm just going to sit here and do nothing. Good morning. Happy Thursday. This week is going so fast. I can't believe it's the 15th of April. What? It's going to be May soon. And then it's June, and when it hits June, to me, June in my brain equals like halfway through the year. Because it is. <laughs> Funny that. That's scary. Before we know it, it's going to be Christmas again. Oh my god. I didn't really vlog yesterday. I wasn't really feeling up to it. I didn't get up to much. I did pop on a tan last night, so I'm feeling so much better. Yesterday, I had a meeting with my manager, which I think I filmed actually. We've got some super exciting stuff coming. I'm so excited. You guys have no idea. It's weird. Like, I hope you're excited. I don't know. It's just been such like a long time coming. And like, the funny thing is, you've all seen it. You've all seen it many times and you just probably have no idea. I'm currently making my breakfast. I'm filming of what I eat in a week and I kept, keep forgetting to film what I eat. <laughs> But like, I think because I eat a lot of the same thing, it's okay because I can just repeat the meals anyway. But yeah, stay tuned. My parents come home today, so Bonnie will be going back home. She'll be very excited. Her sleepover's over. Today I want to get some content. I can't speak. I haven't spoken this morning yet. I didn't go to the gym this morning. I'm going to go this afternoon just so I can like have a bit of a break. Get some food into me before I do some like heavy lifting, which by the way, I'm extremely sore. I feel like the tradies can definitely hear me. I haven't been this sore in a very long time. Obviously, because I these movements are movements that I just don't usually do. Um, like we were doing, did I, I think I said this yesterday, but like the bruise on my collarbone, it's gone down a bit. <laughs> and I've got one like under my chin. Oh, my bracelet's just come off and it's floating around in my jumper. Also, this set is from, is it beginning? It's really cute, but I got in a house delivery yesterday. Super exciting. I know I'm gonna get so many comments being like, it's gonna get dirty. I know, it probably can't stay here, but 
you don't even know what it is. It's a rug. It's from Rugs of Beauty. I will try and link it below. I do have a discount code with them as well. I have another one coming that's going to be for like the living area. I'm not sure what my code is. I'll pop it on the screen though and that gets you some money off. But zero minutes left. It's like a like hallway runner rug or like a like a skinny one. <laughs> so I know it's like so cute. It's like this type of pattern you can see or like texture. So it's really thick. <laughs> and I love how that looks. However, it's going to get food on it. Like, I know. Probably might want to pop it in the kitchen, um, in the hallway, since it is like a hallway rug. I don't know. We'll see. I love the feeling of it, though. It's super nice quality. And I think it looks really nice there. Maybe I could get, like, a darker one for there. Lonnie's just asleep. <laughs> I'm really excited for the one that's going to go here. Kiara. Kiara had a haircut the other, like, month, really. Um, because she gets really like matted fur quite easily. So she's growing her little fur back. Hey, <laughs> you're very pretty. Gotcha. She's a rag doll, by the way. You're a blue point rag doll. Ooh, look at that. Look at that stretch. She looks so small when she's got her fur like shorter. Because when she's all fluffy, she's very big. The rug will be like here and stuff. I also popped some of these books. Um, Freya found this one from the thrift shop. This one, my brother um, and his girlfriend got it for me for Christmas. I think you can get these from Kmart online. Don't quote me. Or I think maybe Maya. Just like search up like coffee table books and you might be able to find them. Um, and then those vases. Oh my God, my voice. And then the, this vase is from Paola. Paola. I can't say it. People were roasting me in the comments last week. <laughs> I don't know how to say it, but that's from... I'll pop up on the screen. And I'm so excited because my coffee table from Temple and Webster has finally shipped. It took a bit longer than usual. So I think that's going to look so nice. Um, for that. Making my way downtown. The pancakes always turn out the best when you cook them really slowly. I also had a pretty good night's sleep last night. I've been sleeping really badly, like I've said. Update on those little, like, where are they? These sleep tablets. I think they work. It's hard to know whether it's like placebo or just, I think I slept all right last night. Like I, I didn't take forever to go to sleep. Um, and yesterday I didn't feel like, what was it? I think Tuesday, Tuesday when I woke up at five and went to the gym, I had to have a nap during the day, which I, I don't like doing because I feel so lazy. I hate it. Like I'm always like, I shouldn't be napping, but like <laughs> my body's just not used to waking up really early, going to the gym early and like, doing that yeah. whereas yesterday I didn't feel too tired like I was pretty all right and then today I was worried that I was gonna wake up at like seven or whatever and then be super tired and sleep until like nine but I woke up before my alarm at like 6 50 which I was like okay we're getting back into a regular scheduled program for Connor it's 8 21 right now I'm just doing yeah Breakfast, cleaning, I cleaned up a little bit. I'm gonna write my to-do list because I wanna get some stuff done today. And then I'm gonna go to the gym this afternoon. That's the plan. And then tomorrow's Friday and I'm gonna meet up with Georgia, Ellie and Rachel. I'm so excited for that. I am so hungry. Do you guys have any recommendations for like things to help you sleep? I have got my moon milk from Naked Harvest and I feel like that always tells my brain like, right, it's sleep time. But yeah, let me know if you have recommendations. My biceps hurt, my shoulders hurt, but I love it. So it's now 9.37. I think I'm going to head off now just because I need to, I think I'm going to allow plenty of time to get there. My hair kind of looks a bit weird. I think because it's like dirty hair. I don't know how to curl my hair when it's like dirty. You know, do you ever have those days where you just look at yourself and you're like, I look a bit strange today. <laughs> Not for any particular reason. Something's off. I have, I'm having one of those days. But it's Friday today. So yeah, I'm going to a cafe called Yoke. 
which is such a weird name, but um, it's in Newstead, I think. I'm gonna meet up with Ellie, Rachel, and Georgia. I'm so excited. I haven't seen Ellie and George since the Byron trip, and I haven't seen Rachel, I think, since she came to my 21st birthday. I think that's the last time I saw her. Was it? Yeah, I think it was. And I think the day after my 21st birthday, she got engaged. It's been that long. Um, I got my period yesterday, by the way. So that was a 25 day cycle. So good that I got my period, but it was kind of like a bit soon. Like I thought it was gonna be in like a week's time. So it's like a bit early, but better that period than no period, I think, surely, I don't know. But yeah, I'm gonna head off in a second. I'll show you my outfit. Just having some of my compound from my naturopath Tia and some Genora. I made oats for breakfast, which will be in my what I eat in a week video. And they're all right. I don't know. I did really prefer, I really wish that I had pancakes, but I'm trying to not have pancakes all the time because I know it's like, it's been like months at this point. But anyway, this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing the pretty little thing jeans. I've got them like covering my ankle. And then this little top is from Princess Polly. Um, this is what it looks like though, if you haven't seen like the color. Although it looks quite nice now that actually. So it's just a bit darker. I need some lip gloss. But um, and I got a jacket just because it's a bit cold, I think. Cold in Brisbane, it means you can wear a little itty bitty crop top like this and jeans. That's cold. <laughs> I have a feeling we're gonna be there for ages and just talk and talk and talk, which is so lovely. It's the best feeling being able to chat to other people in the industry. Um, because it's just really nice because I don't have that like work colleague that I can chat to on a day-to-day -day basis So this will be really really good um, and I didn't charge my camera. Stunning. All right, let's Get crack off and as I said two seconds before Don't it don't waste any time Chasing the ghost don't try I'm top of the show put you up to self to somebody else Okay, it would make sense if they were giving me a hundred Happy Monday. This is gonna be very confusing because you're probably thinking, if you have, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you're probably like, what's been going on? Basically, it is actually Monday as I'm filming this, but I'm re-filming this clip because I lost the clip that I filmed on Monday explaining the fact that there was no weekly vlog last week and I was gonna start a new weekly vlog and kind of put it all together in this one big video. However, I lost that clip. I hope I'm making sense. So I'm re-filming it now. So it's actually like two months, anyway, doesn't matter. But I also lost a clip um, where I got a package in from Macro Mike. So I wanted to show you that because I make some brownies that I got in the package. So it just wouldn't make sense. Anyway. <laughs> Just a brief explanation as to why there was no weekly vlog. If you don't follow me on Instagram, I was just getting to the end of the week where I wasn't really filming that much. I just felt so over it. Like I wasn't motivated to film. So it was like Friday night and I was just like lying in bed and I thought I just have to give this week a miss. I said, I just thought it's not good enough. Like I don't feel happy with the footage and I don't want to just put up a video just for the sake of it. Like I love doing the weekly vlog. It is my favorite thing. It is my thing, like it's what I do. Um, but I just was like, I need a little bit of a break. Um, so I decided to just leave the weekly vlog, take that footage and then put it into this video that you're watching now, hence why it's Monday. But I'm re-filming this clip. <laughs> so, um, and I've got like crusty tan on and it's just, it's a lot of whack. So I hope you guys understand. I think I definitely need to implement more weeks off for my weekly vlog. I think the content would really benefit from that. I think I would benefit from that. I'm not saying at all that I don't enjoy doing it because I do, I love vlogging and it would actually be kind of hard to not vlog like in the weeks, I love doing it. But I think everyone needs a break here or there. So I think every now and then when I can, like when I'm able to, like if I don't have any content, like a sponsored video or whatever, like I can just not vlog a week, just have a break like completely, like just not film. I think that would be really, really beneficial for my mental health and just, what was that? And I think, it, you know, it's, it's, I don't know why I'm explaining the fact that I need a break. Like it's normal, it's human nature. We need to have breaks. So maybe in like a month's time or whenever, I will have a week off and just not vlog. Yeah, so that's the situation. I got a few DMs asking like where the weekly vlog was and I'm so sorry for everyone who like really looks forward to it because I love it. It's like 
It's my favorite thing, but yeah, that's the situation. So this video is gonna be hella long because it's kind of a compilation of two weeks. Anyway, I'm gonna stop rambling, but that's a synopsis of, about what has happened. So I got in a package from Macro Mike and I lost the footage of it, but I wanted to show you anyway. They're on my pantry. BTW, there is a try and haul of the stacks goodies at the end of the vlog. Here we have all of my Macro Mike stuff. I already made some brownies that you will see after this clip, but they sent a big box of their clean cookies. These are incredible. We've got maple choc chip. Um, these are my favorite, the birthday cake. And then these are double choc fudge. So yummy. And then we've also got a couple of these, which I've eaten some of them already. They are a protein bar, but they're more of like, they don't call them a protein bar, they call it a protein snack bar. It's more like um, like a fruit thingy. I can't explain it. So we've got blueberry, this is like a jam donut flavor. And then this is like an Easter egg one. Delicious. And then we've got some more mixes. I might make one of these today actually. This is the salted caramel cookie baking mix. This is the banana bread one and then a donut one. Thank you so much, Macro Mac. Oh wait, no, I also got this, which is my favorite thing ever. It's the powdered almond butter. This is the chocolate biscuit one, I think. And you just mix it with water and it's just a little bit more like calorically less dense than regular peanut butter because don't get me wrong, regular peanut butter is my favorite thing, but it's just, she's very high in calories, you know? Um, so yeah, I don't have a discount card with them, but maybe I'll get one soon. Let's get back to the regular scheduled programming. I don't know what's next after this clip. Oh, this vlog's gonna be so long. Anyway, I hope you still enjoy the video. Peace out, but not really. Okay, so it's now like 5 p.m. I was gonna go to the gym this afternoon, but I was like, eh, I'll just leave it because I had to go this morning. It, this afternoon's class is much more of like strength than like very slow, just like heavy weights though. But I was just like, eh. Um, I don't know what happened. I don't know. My tan did not stick to me this time around. Like I tanned on Wednesday and it's Monday today and I pretty much just scrubbed it all off in the shower and I'm going to re-tan tonight, I think. Probably would like leave it until closer to the weekend because I have an event, but um, I need to get content and stuff. And I don't know what happened. Sometimes tans just don't work out, but I'm going to make the brownies. Um, I've got a dish here that says it's microwave and oven safe without the lids so i don't know i washed my hair too by the way because i'm just gonna probably wash it again tomorrow but it says pour this into a mixing bowl add water i'm just gonna pour it although do i need to line it? i'm just gonna pour it straight in here actually no i'm gonna spray that and then, yeah never mind i'm making brownies she's gone she she literally missed about two seconds what you doing where you at Oh, you got plans. Don't say that. That song has been stuck in my head for like two weeks now. I'm probably gonna pop out to Woolworths too, maybe just to get some groceries. Let's pour this in here. I'm so excited. Pour that in there. It's a lot. 250 mils of water or a nut milk. Almond milk it is. And now I mix, I suppose. We go together like da 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 da. Yum. Ooh, look at that. Kind of looks gross when you take a photo of it. I can't tell if it looks disgusting or. <gasps> oh, it's getting real thick. Maybe I need to mix it. Somewhere. Yeah. Give it a bit of elbow grease, eh? Yum. Okay, I think that looks better. Just shining the light so you can see its goodness. <gasps> Yum. I'm gonna spray this tray with a bit of oil. So this is to transfer onto a lined or non-stick baking tray. This is non-stick at this point in time. You're about to see a lot of um, macro mic items being baked in the next couple vlogs. Oh yes. I didn't realize there were like actual chocolate chips in here. I'm going to wait for the oven to preheat and then I'm going to pop it in there for 25 to 30 minutes. Alrighty, grocery haul. Hopefully that lighting isn't too bad, but I just got back from the supermarket. Look at my brownies. Oh my gosh. I like messaged Freya to take them out of the oven. 
So, they look pretty done to me. Oh no, I'm gonna break it, I'm gonna break it, I'm gonna break it. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Oh, look at that. It's all. Where is your dinner, Remy? Yay, can I count? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yummy. Oof. Like, let me show you. They're so, like, gooey on the inside. Sexy. No. Why? <laughs> Don't listen to her. It tastes so good. Isn't the protein is free? Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Mm. Taste the stevia in everything. I ran away from heartbreak. Got nothing in return for my pain. I never thought I'd be so empty, so alone. Right, so I've had a pretty productive day today. Um, it's about 3.22. I'm getting ready to go to the gym. Um, I did some editing. I've still got some work to do, I think, when I get back. But I can, like, do that on my laptop while I'm, like, watching TV and stuff. I got some photos, some stories. Um, I was meant to have a meeting. I don't know if I said this. Oh, I've got a pimple. Lovely. I was meant to have a meeting this morning, but it got pushed back to tomorrow. But yeah, I'm mixing this Macro Mark peanut butter stuff. It's too watery, but that's all right. On a rice cake, and I just had, I've just eaten random stuff. Like I felt a little bit hungry. So I've had like this, a carrot and some hummus, and a brownie. I think I've had like three of those brownies today. They're so yum, the Macro Mark one. For a bit of a pre-workout. So I'm wearing this to the gym, bit of color. Yum. I think I definitely prefer working out in the morning. I like both. It just depends what I've got on, I guess. Like tomorrow, I think I will go in the morning. Yeah. And then Thursday will probably be in the evening one. We'll see. Do I make a coffee? Probably afraid. Looking for a lover Nobody understood where I've been I guess I thought I needed more time To protect my love from potential offense So I Then you Good morning guys <laughs> Give me one second Slightly better Good morning guys, happy Wednesday. I was gonna go to the gym this morning, but again, I had a really bad night's sleep and I couldn't get to sleep till like after midnight. And if I were to get up at 5 a.m. and go to the gym, I would be exhausted throughout the day. I don't know what, I mean, I probably do. I've just never had this problem before. It's probably a little something called caffeine. Like, obviously, Connor. I'm so I don't like not being able to sleep. And I don't know if it's like placebo now because when you go to bed, you think, well, I'm not gonna fall asleep. Then you're not gonna fall asleep. But anyway, didn't go to the gym this morning. I also do have a meeting though at 7.45. So if I did go to the gym, I was gonna have to like race home. And then tonight I have something fun on actually as well. But I have a very exciting meeting at 7.45 and I look like this. I don't think I'm gonna put any makeup on it. <laughs> Also, this tan is really nice. I don't know if it looks nice on camera. The elbows, I can never get, I need to moisturize. But it's by Coco and Eve. You can't even see it, but it's really nice. My lips always look really puffy in the mornings. I need to actually, that's what I should do, start jade rolling, de-puff, you know? Kiara's just sitting outside on the chair in the sun. I've been doing a lot of editing on my own laptop, just because I've been able to like sit on the couch and stuff. 
But yeah, the reason why my meeting is so early is because it's for something very exciting that's coming. I'm getting my nails done today, which I'm so excited for. I'm going to like a nail tech. I really like Jazz's nails that she gets done. Like I've never, I'm so excited. I just, like I would do them myself, but like I just decided let's just do something nice. I probably should have another look, but I think these are Isabel Clark's nails, but I love that. Like the tortoiseshell vibe. I probably can't get them too long, obviously, because of the gym. I think that's Jazz. But like, I kind of want them a no, no, I can't get them long. But like that shape I really love too. Like when I go back and watch my old videos, let me actually look at run right now. And I see my nails. I like, half of me is like, whoa. And then the other half of me is like, I miss that. <laughs> Look, I don't know, I do, I just love, like Freya's gonna get hers done too. Not, not today, but like eventually. And then these are really cool too. They have like a gold border. Did I even say, the, yeah, the reason why my meeting is so early is because it's not with just my manager, it's with some people, other people. <laughs> um, international, I think they're in New York, which is really cool. I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> It is crazy though when I actually think about like, since I have basically almost documented every single week, I can go back and be like, what did I do? What did I do on this week, in this month? Like I can, I know what it is. Oh my God, this is so long. <laughs> Little diamantes. God, Carl, I still love it though. Cause I have very short hand, like I have tiny hands and I always wanted to make them look really nice and elongated and like, pretty like if they were yeah like they're an accessory and i loved it hi yeah. how are you doing anything you might need to ask me about about getting some more rings because i don't have enough apparently i'm gonna have a look on anna louisa they have gorgeous rings oh yes and they're like super sustain this is not sponsored by anna louisa but they're really sustainable i love chunky rings anyway i'm gonna go make my breakfast now and and i'm gonna do some editing have a shower Ooh, bit of a bruise on my shoulder and i will just in me one my baby it had to be you Ooh. I didn't seem to notice that you were checking for me we were just friends but we started building trust and my fragile heart started to mend yeah You would have been the obvious choice But I needed time to see clearly Dig deep and cut through the noise So I Then you Okay, oh, I look crazy I just got done getting my nails done Oh my god, I'm obsessed. Um, look at them. I'll, I'll show you when I get home, but it's now 2 p.m. I'm going to meet up with Rachel and Georgia, I think, tonight, and then the Meshka twins at their hotel because they're staying in Brisbane. We're just gonna get like Uber Eats and stuff. That's at 5.30, so it's 2 p.m. now. So I don't really wanna drive all the way home, like be home for a bit and then just turn around. I think I'm gonna go to Sephora. I just like kill some time before I go drive to their hotel. We'll see, so I just don't wanna go home. I'm obsessed with these. I don't think they'll be too long for the gym. I don't think so. Anyway, I'm gonna go in, have a little walk around. My new nails, look at them. I'm gonna pop my AirPods in. Alrighty, let's see. I've been listening to a lot of Chase Atlantic at the moment. Oh, it's trying to connect. Alright, chat to you later. And you, lady, but I, so you. Okay, 
okay. Don't Everyone mind me, I'm just about to out. vlog. Thank you. No one wants to. I'm okay. This is not going to be any I know. Hello, guys. Okay, it's now like 6.42. I don't remember the last time I spoke. Oh, I think I was in the car park. I'm on my phone. I'm here with Rachel, George, Ash and Liv. Hi. Hi. Welcome to this great quality. Um, I have never been so stressed out in my life when it oh comes to gosh. parking. I don't know why. I just took so many wrong turns. I couldn't find the hotel. I was like walking around the city trying to like figure out where to park. I had walked past it though. I just didn't see it. But it's, yeah, we've all just ordered a bit of Uber Eats. I'm getting um, Nando's. Oh. What are you getting? G.I.G. GYG. What Liv's getting Thai. What are you getting, Ash? GYG. And then George is getting GYG as well. So. GYG Nando's. Mm -hmm. What did you actually get? It's like, it's called a super fuel salad. Sounds boring, but it's actually really nice. With chicken. Sounds good. So. Okay. This is the hotel room. Very cute. Hello. <laughs> Got the kids. Look at that. That actually looks incredible. I know. That sounds really good. I'll I know. That. Yum. I just can't eat it because I have no calories. <laughs> <laughs> Dinner with the girls in their hotel was really nice. I've been out since like, I don't even know. Um, I, it's 9.30 now, I'm just snacking because like my salad was quite small that I had. So, how did I come through? The reason why I went to the Westfield that I did was to go to the Sephora to get the Way Matte Pomade, like I said. They didn't even have it in stock, so I may just have to order online, I don't know. So instead, I bought something that I didn't need. This is from Huda Beauty. It's the, I don't know how to say it, but it's her perfume. This is the vanilla one. And the notes are vanilla orchard, tonka absolute, brown sugar, amber woods, and musk. The packaging is gorgeous. Um, my camera's gonna die, by the way. It smells, it reminds me of YSL Black Opium, but it's not YSL Black Opium. like. It's beautiful, the packaging is stunning. So I was like, yeah, let's just buy this. And then I got this like Jergens Natural Glow Gradual Tanning Moisturizer. Why? I don't know. <laughs> and that's all I got. Well, I've never been so stressed out in my life with that whole parking, driving in the city situation. And I'm gonna have a Mexican bowl just here, but I had that last night. And it's definitely so timely enough, so I ordered some lemonade. Morning, folks. The tradies are blasting music today. I've just got out my roller. This is by this brand. Um, and I put it in the freezer, so it's freezing cold. I don't know, I know you, I think you're meant to go in like one direction. Feels really nice. Cause I have a really puffy face in the morning. Like my lips are always really puffy. And I also have this thing, which I think is a glasser. And I think it's, you're meant to do this. For like lymphatic drainage. Ooh. This feels weird. Just made my breakfast. It's um 8 a.m. I'm gonna go to the gym this afternoon. Today's gonna be a big editing day. Hopefully. Or delivery day. Okay, I've just been editing. Doing a lot of editing. I've got like pimple patches on. Not looking cute. Exciting delivery. All right, so I've been really wanting some chairs. These are gonna be like dining room chairs. Am I gonna get a dining table? Probably not yet, which may seem silly, but I'm gonna like put these kind of in the house. I'm gonna be able to use them for like content. Look at the chairs. They're from Eureka Street Furniture. Um, Eureka Street have gorgeous stuff. So they literally just came then. Oh, you've probably seen these chairs on Instagram, but I think look at them. They look so funny because there's six of them, which is a lot for like my house, but oh, aren't they just absolutely gorgeous? They had them in black and like a lighter color, like a like a white and the is this called rattan? I'm sorry. Oh, I was a little bit worried that the tone of the wood wouldn't match the floorboards, but I think they look great. 
It's nice to have like a little bit of a darker wood. I'm gonna move this outside because this is meant to be like outside furniture anyway. It's just been that long. So as you can see outside, I've got kind of a couple of the chairs there. Obsessed. Even just having them sat there makes me like so excited. So I'm gonna, first of all, we have a seat in them. Pretty comfy. I'd rate that. Okay, I'm gonna move this outside though. They're nice and like heavy, like really nice quality. The coffee table will go here. I don't know that, anyway. Okay, oh my god, there's so many. <laughs> Probably didn't need six, but like, let me first. I love the colour. I think the colours are stunning. And there's we on the floor. Great. I'm gonna put two of them like here. Oh, the aesthetic. The aesthetic, the aesthetic is real. Then I put two, one of them in the corner over here. They are so sexy. Oh my gosh. Probably not gonna have them all here. I'm gonna leave those two there definitely. But like, I don't think I'm getting a dining table for a while, but um, her over here. I actually quite like the look of the green with it too. It's really nice complimentary. I just put one in here. I also just got in a couple more packages just then. I got in a package from Crumbled Foods and I know Sophie, Sophie Jane Miller. Look at me with my Stanley knife. I think this is the first time I've opened a package with a Stanley knife before. Soph has spoken about these before. I love bars. Any type of bar. So we've got Salted Caramel Beauty Bites. <laughs> salted Caramel Beauty Bites. Snack your way to glowing skin. Ooh. I'm going to show you my nails in like the daylight. Aren't they pretty? I love them. We've got... What flavor is that? Salted Caramel. White Chocolate Raspberry. Apple cinnamon. Ooh, yum. Oh my gosh, there's so many. Triple chocolate chip. Chocolate cherry coconut and lemon coconut. Ooh. Oh my god, look at them all. <laughs> Thank you so much. I kind of want to try one. Salted caramel is always white chocolate raspberry sounds like an absolute time and a half. Ooh, I want to try one actually. Let me see. What do I want? Chocolate. White chocolate raspberry sounds like a bit of me. They're like little itty bitty ones, which is nice. So like, if you're out and about, you can just pop them in your bag. So yeah, this is the white chocolate salted, no, white chocolate raspberry. That's what it looks like. Mmm. Yum. Five grams of protein too. It's really rich. I wouldn't be able to eat like a big bar of it. day so far i managed to get this video ready to go for tonight it is a 1 in a week oh this lighting is so overexposed but it's now 1 p.m i've just been doing my makeup for some reason i decided to go very glam one i'm about to film some content for covergirl which is like super exciting i feel like covergirl is one of those brands that are just like wow they're actually on it's on their outlast all day custom nudes lip products they're actually really cool basically it has like a liquid lipstick in one and then like a kind of like a gloss slash balm on the other and you use them in like conjunction with each other you use them in conjunction with each other and they last for ages so this is like 
one of the colors here I'm gonna put on. And then I've got some brighter ones, but I think, yeah, I'm gonna go for the nude. But, I didn't, but my makeup is quite dramatic. So I did put mascara on my lower lashes, but I looked crazy. <laughs> I just ate some blueberries too, by the way, because I'm going out tonight. So I was like, well, I may as well just do my makeup now, film this content. And then by the time everything's done, I'll probably get ready to go. I'm gonna brush out these curls. Um, hopefully they last. I'm gonna... My hair sometimes holds curls really well and then other times it just does not. So... Fringe looks alright. That is the hair. It looks quite short today because it's quite curled. I'm gonna spray it generously. Some hairspray. Get that to stay. <laughs> through it to kind of break up the hair spray but yeah tonight we're going to maya mexican for my friend michaela's birthday I'm excited it's a very nice place i've been there i think once before so yeah i'm gonna wear my white set that's from princess polly because i love that set it's so stunning but yeah i'm gonna apply to these so i can't see anything i also put um white eyeliner in my waterline i used to do that all the time and i haven't done it in a while it's always so funny to me to like be super glam in the middle of the day i mean it is a friday today but like it'll be a tuesday and like if i'm filming content and i look like this it's just funny how like this is my job <laughs> doesn't because it's weird yeah i haven't done like super glam makeup in so long lined my lips i'm gonna let that set and then you go in with this on top my beautiful chairs in the background my hair looks really brown at the moment. Still so obsessed with them. I think they look gorgeous. I'll leave the link down below if you're keen to check them out. I got a quite a few DMs asking like where they're from, what they are. Okay, so it's now like four, just after 4 p.m. And I got my content today and I'm ready to go out for drinks for Michaela's birthday. We're going to, I think, yeah, I think I said. This is the makeup. Bit more dramatic than my usual. I think my mum's coming to <laughs> drop me off because she's a gem. I'll show you what I'm wearing. So this is from... Princess Polly. I've worn it before and I have it in black. It's just so beautiful. I think it's just like so classy. This is a little crop and the pants. It's called the Huxley set, I'm pretty sure. And then I've got some heels. I've got these nude heels to go with it. These are from Nasty Gal. They're super comfy. You don't really see them anyway, but it's just. And then this is the jewelry I've got on my nails. Baby, it's your birthday. Oh. Baby, it's your birthday. Oh. Baby, it's your birthday. Now you don't have to wait no more. So get ready, get ready, get ready. Just want you for myself, Bobby. Let me show you what. It is actually Monday as I'm filming this, but not gonna lie, if you saw from the Friday night clips, I think I was hungover. My version of hungover is just feeling really like sluggish for like the next couple days afterwards. Like yesterday I felt fine. I just felt a bit like tired and like my eyes, my eyes were really strained, probably one from editing, but also from drinking. But I wanted to show you the new Stax Originals collection that's coming out, which is really cool. It comes out on Friday, so you're watching this on Monday. Um, so it's going to be launching at Friday. I'm pretty sure 9am. I'll pop it on the screen and have the info down below. There are a few other colours in the collection. Hang on. It's probably better if I just show you. So this is in their Best Black fabric, which is so buttery soft, gorgeous. I am obsessed with the new midi shorts that they've come out with. Um, I think they came out with them on my birthday, actually. Um, so I've got them in a bunch of different colors, but this is in a gorgeous brown. These bottoms are in an extra, extra small. The, these crops are actually in an extra, extra small. I think they accidentally sent me this size. I normally would wear a, an extra small, even a small. It is definitely more fitted, but I don't think it like looks like it doesn't look like it's too small, if you know what I mean. Also, my tan, it's on its last legs. Um, and the bruises on my knees. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing, but um, apparently having a great time. But yeah, how nice. Super flattering. Color is just gorgeous. 
um, I think when I go to the gym today, I probably will wear one of these colors. They've also come out with like a high neck crop as well, which just has very like, I love the vibe, how it's just like originals on the back. Sometimes I feel like really high neck things don't suit me, my hair. This is what the like high neck tank, quite cool. It would look really nice with jeans. Like you could totally wear this as like athleisure. It's not a sports bra, so it doesn't have any support, but it's really comfy actually. Wow, I actually don't mind that. Okay, this is the green color. So these are the full length tights. Again, extra, extra small. They are very like, so these are in like the gorgeous green color, gorgeous greens. I think if you missed out, I don't know if they still sell the Jade Seamless. This is pretty much the exact same color, just in the best black fabric. So if you love that color, which it's probably my favorite color, I get complimented on it every time I wear it to the gym because it's such a different green. Like you don't really see this type of green. It's got the Stacks logo. And then this is like the strappy crop. So it's a little bit less supportive than the other one. In my opinion, that's what it looks like at the back. And then these are full length on me, like if I pull my socks down. Um, don't mind the bruise on my ankle. Um, that's how long they are on me. All right, so these are the back shorts in the midi length version, same deal. So beautiful. They are very short, so they are probably gonna ride up a little bit, like that's natural, um, but they're not like so short to begin with where you feel like you're wearing underwear to the gym. And then these are the crops. I definitely think I prefer an extra small and I'm about like a D cup, I would say. So they still fit me if you're wondering. Same thing, this is the high neck um, originals crop. I won't try this on. I will try on though the long brown ones. All right, and then this is the, I think it's, I don't know if it's called umber, but it's like basically the same color as the umber in the seamless collection. These are the full length tights. It's just the most beautiful like chocolate brown color. So beautiful. I'm just trying to find some decent lighting guys. Why do I sound sick? I promise I'm not. Um, but yeah, everything launches this Friday. So that is the 20, that's the 30th of April. Bloody hell. It launches at 9 a.m. Um, Australian Eastern Standard Time or Daylight Time. Cause I'm pretty sure Daylight Savings is not a thing anymore. Like. It's, it's finished. So yeah, make sure you follow me on Instagram if you want to see, because I'll probably post about it like when it's happening and everything. So yeah, but my code is kind of 10 and that gets you 10% off stacks. Um, and I always appreciate it so much when you guys use my code. Yeah, I'm going to end off this weekly vlog here. Thank you guys for watching this weekly vlog. I know it was probably really, really long. And thank you for being so understanding about me missing last week. I definitely want to implement more breaks with the weekly vlog. I get burnt out, whether that's subconsciously or I'm aware of it. Like, I just think it's really good to just have a break where I just don't touch my camera. Absence makes the heart grow fonder in like every shape and form. My videos really benefit from a week off here and there. So, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're having a lovely day or night wherever you are in the world and I will see you in my next one. <laughs> Bye. I don't know. I said that so weirdly. Oh gosh. Bye.